Well, a wild chase and shootout in Wailai last April ended with a Honolulu police officer killing one of two suspects. And tonight, that officer is being honored for her actions. The shooting stemmed from a crime spree that began downtown, went into Manoa, then ended up in East Honolulu. As KITV4's Amber Lynn Hyden reports, seven officers involved in the incident were recognized for putting their lives on the line to protect Manage the public. The, the events that occurred on this day were horrific. These two suspects were violent and desperate. Armed gunman Mark Leong Ani fired shots at police officers on Kaleniana Ole Highway and Ainakoa Avenue after he and another suspect, Michael Manning Jr., crashed a stolen car near Kaleni High School. Students were just getting out of school at the time of the shooting. Officer Nicholas Masagatani, who drove his car at Leong Ani, said he never imagined something like this happening. I kind of just have to put myself in a frame of mind where I was playing a game or it wasn't real, that whatever was happening wasn't actually happening and just fell back on training. Officer Terry Engagio tried to stop a carjacking by steering his squad car between the gunman and the targeted truck. Police say the gunman fired at the officer. The round actually went into my, my vehicle, a pillar on the passenger side, so it was, it was a pretty close call for me. <laughs> Police say the suspect continued firing gunshots at police before Officer Lovina Canijo fired back, killing him. The second suspect was caught later during a carjacking attempt after he robbed homes and stolen crashed another car. Today, three officers, including Masagatani and Canijo, were given HPD's highest award, the Warrior Gold Medal of Valor. Canijo is the first woman in the department's history to receive this medal. Officer Engagio received the Warrior Silver Medal of Valor, HPD's second highest award. As bad as it was, it could have been a lot worse. So we're, we're happy that we're all, we're all still here. So. Those honored today agreed the safety of their colleagues and the public meant more than any award. Other officers who responded to the shooting were also recognized. One received the Bronze Medal of Valor and two others received Warrior Certificates of Merit. Suspect Michael Manning pleaded guilty in October to multiple charges in this case.